Beijing provides huge support for both the people and the economy of Kodiak. On Kodiak, not everyone fully understands the importance of having Kodiak's fisheries. It improves our way of living. In fact, if it weren't for fishing industries, we wouldn't have an enormous new high school, a great swimming pool, and many other types of infrastructure. Kodiak would not look like what it looks like today without the fishing industries. To many people, fish is an excellent source of food and fun to catch. Additionally, people earn paychecks based on working with fish. On one end, you will find cannery workers who are working long hours to support their own families. On the other end is the harbor master who manages the ports and harbors, as well as many other duties. Then there are the fishermen who work hard and enjoy their jobs, sailing out on the waters to fish. All in all, fishing creates Kodiak's lifestyle. My name is Lon White. I'm the port director and harbor master for the city of Kodiak. My name is Alderman Montilla. I'm an upcoming sophomore in Kodiak High School. Well, I'm Marty Owen. I live here in Kodiak. My name is Toby Sullivan, and I'm a commercial fisherman from Kodiak. I'm Ray Suya, Jessica's dad. My name is Angelique Grantham, and I'm the writer and historian. Kodiak is a big fishing town, and, and there's a lot of different kinds of fish and crabs that get caught of, out of Kodiak. So there's a lot of boats and a lot of fishermen. It's a really big industry in Kodiak. Commercial fishing is a very exciting and, and rewarding career. You get to work with your hands, you're outdoors on the ocean. It can be in a very harsh environment at times. There's lots of different commercial fishing that goes on in Kodiak. Summer. Pollock, salmon, halibut, cod, a little bit of shrimp, scallops, and, I mean the whole gamut, sea cucumbers. Formerly we had a really big crab industry here. We also used to be the largest shrimp port in the world for a time being. I've seen people fish several times, whether out at sea or by the river. Summertime, obviously, it's really heavy with salmon. Also during the summer, there's halibut. The truth is, it's probably only about 25% of the deliveries in Kodiak are salmon, so there's lots of other things. And then there's crab fishing. So there's lots of different kinds of commercial fisheries. It encapsulates a lot of different types of seafood, and a lot of different types of vessels and gear. I think a lot of Kodiak's economy is based off fish. I'm not sure if Kodiak would be here without the fishing industry. The things that we've all come to know and enjoy, like having all these paved roads and beautiful high schools, it's, it is a way of life. It's a, it's a wonderful way of life. There will be no engineering or people around here if, the, if it's not for fishing industry. I've got to see young people grow up and be from being crew members to being boat owners and uh, doing very well financially. People that have died, had accidents or tragedies at sea, and that's the other, that's the flip side of commercial fishing is the extremes, the hardships that can occur. You don't understand it until you experience it, you know, what the, what commercial fishing means to you. If we didn't have commercial fishing, Kodiak would be uh, very different than we town we've come to know and enjoy. A huge operation. More cameras are being built. There's more jobs. <laughs>